Hi guys, how's everyone doing? Okay, let's pause for a moment before. Um, how's everyone doing, guys? Good evening. Man, this is my eye condition getting bad. I can't even see. How's everyone doing? Okay, it's time for our webinar, so let's wait for more people to join while I'm still waiting for the Zoom link. How's everyone doing? Let me know where you're watching this from. Let me know what, where you're watching this from. Okay, I think I will start as soon as uh, my CEO sends me the Zoom link, we'll start. How's everyone doing? So, um, I just want to test to make sure everyone is hearing me. As soon as we start, I'm going to turn off the comments to avoid distractions. So today we are basically going to be talking about um, understanding the Arbitrator app and how you can learn and end with the, with the app. So I will basically be talking about all the features of the app, everything that the app does. So many persons have followed me on this page, downloaded the app, but they don't really understand how to use it. So that is what I'm going to be talking about. So let's wait for more people to join while we are waiting for the Zoom link. This particular program is supposed to be streamed to a Zoom only audience, but we are adding Facebook and Instagram of our business pages and uh, my personal page. For those of you seeing me for the first time, my name is Gaius Chibuze, aka Bitcoin Chief. I am the Chief Marketing um, Officer for Abit Network. So, the uh, the product of Abit Network that we are going to be talking about today is called Abit Trader, and basically I will be introducing you to some of the exciting features of the app and how to use it. Okay, I think I might just have to wait for whenever uh, whenever my CTO is able to join with the link. Okay guys, so I'm going live on all the pages. Super amazing evening, guys. How is everyone doing? How is everyone? Thank you so much, guys, on Facebook for joining. Thank you, everyone, on um, Abit Network page. Thank you, everyone, on Abit Trader page. So today, basically, we are going to be talking about um, the Abit Trader app. So before, I'm going to turn off the comments for 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 these pages but before that I, I want i want you to type we can hear you if you can hear me just type we can hear you so i can proceed okay good i believe everyone is hearing me i believe everyone is hearing me so basically i'll be turning off the comments now so we can focus on what we are about to discuss good 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 Perfect, we can hear you. Thank you so much, guys, on Abit Network. Victor, give me, give me a glass of water. Good, 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 good. So everyone can hear me now. So if you, if you have your phones, I believe you have your phones in your hands right now. If you've not downloaded the Abit Trader app, first thing you should do right now before we get started is download the Abit Trader app, A B I T R A D E R. So I will wait, I will give some time for you guys to download the app. Those of you, many of you have been coming to me, how can I buy Bitcoin? How can I buy Tatcoin? How can I buy Ethereum? How can I buy so so and so? How can I profit from cryptocurrency? So it's very important that you download the app now. Yeah, thank you. It's very important that you download the Arbitrader app. I'm going to be introducing you to some of the exciting features of the app how you can use the app to learn about cryptocurrencies uh, thank you and how you can profit from 
some of the cryptocurrencies listed on the app. Okay, so Arbitrader, as the name implies, um, it's a cryptocurrency application. The first and the most important thing is that Arbitrader is an educational platform. In 2015, I started promoting Bitcoin uh, 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 full time, and one of the one of the most asked questions then I always have and. I still get that question up till now is what is Bitcoin? So many persons watching this video right now don't know anything about Bitcoin, but they have been hearing people talk about it. They hear people say that they are making money from Bitcoin, but they don't really know what Bitcoin is. So myself and my team decided to create this application called Arbitrader. So the first job of this application is that it is a learning, it's an educational platform where people can learn about Bitcoin and other cryptocurrencies. People can learn about the origin of Bitcoin. People can learn about the market. People can learn about what drives the demand and supply. People can learn about what influences the price. There are so many things that you can learn on this Arbitrader app. So it's first of all an educational platform where if, you download, if you've downloaded this app now and you've signed in, the first thing you should go and click is how it works. On this how it works, it has two sessions one session for the how the application works the other session for how cryptocurrencies work so on the side of how cryptocurrencies work you will see the first video there tagged what is bitcoin what is bitcoin in 20 i think it was in 2019 one of the most searched phrase on the internet was what is bitcoin so many persons have been wanting to know what Bitcoin is. So the first video on that on the cryptocurrency side of that how it works is that what is Bitcoin. So it explains everything about Bitcoin. I think the second the second uh, video there is tagged what is a Bitcoin wallet. Now there is no how you can hold Bitcoin without having a Bitcoin wallet. So it's very very important for people to understand what is a Bitcoin wallet. I've had cases of people come to me on Instagram and they tell me, please, I just sent my account number. Can you transfer some Bitcoin into my account? Now, now people are sending me their physical bank, bank account, and they want me to transfer Bitcoin to them inside their, inside their normal bank account. So it's very impossible to hold Bitcoin in a bank account. You can hold Bitcoin in something called a bitcoin wallet so that was why we thought we saw the need to produce that video that what is a bitcoin wallet now the third and the most and the third the third the, the third most asked question that people have asked me here on this instagram and social media platforms is how can i make money from bitcoin so we do it so the third video on this application on the cryptocurrency side of how it works it says how do people make money from bitcoin and other cryptocurrencies now you will see that in that video we talked about the different ways where people make money one of the reason bitcoin is becoming so popular today is because of the price volatility that has seen it grow from one cent in 2009 to Fifty-seven thousand dollars that it is this very evening. If you see the progress, if you see the price growth progress of Bitcoin, you see that no other asset, no other asset that exists right now has had this kind of growth for the past ten years. That is why so many uh, so many thought makers like um, CNBC named Bitcoin as the best investment the investment with the most growth for the last 10 decades that ended 2019 so bitcoin has grown from one cent in 2019 in 2009 to to fifty seven thousand dollars today so one of those questions people always ask is how can i make money from this bitcoin if people know what bitcoin is the second is how can they store bitcoin the third is now how can i make money from bitcoin so this is this is why we put the third video there how you can profit from bitcoin and other cryptocurrencies remember that i will be using bitcoin to talk about 
everything that we are going to be discussing today but outside bitcoin we have other types of cryptocurrencies uh victor give me your arbitrator app on your phone let me let me use for this since i'm using all my phones to stream so i'm going to be talking about some of the exciting features of this app i'm going to be talking about some of the exciting features of this app so in my hands right now i'm having um the arbitrator app so i believe some of you can uh some of you have some of you that have two phones you can see what you can take also take a look at the screen too so outside the how it works under the how it works we have the trade signals in 20 in 2015 when i started trading bitcoin full time um myself and my partner and one of my partners bitcoin goddess we started doing something we started sharing trading tips now she was more knowledgeable in technical analysis than myself so so we started sharing sharing trading tips and she would always tell me buy so and so coin buy at so and so price and sell at so and so price so she was always doing that so sometimes too i would also do my own analysis too and i would tell her i said buy this so and so coin and sell so and so so it came to a, a point where an answer and I told her, I said, other people may actually need what we are doing. Some people who don't know how to do technical and fundamental analysis, they, 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 may want, they, they, they may want an opportunity where they can also get trade signals to know the name of the coin to buy, to know which coin to buy, how much to buy, and how much to sell. So a trade signal, so, so that was how we started um, uh, giving out trade signal in i think we started in 2016 officially sending out trade signal we we had we had a group then that we added some persons i was already sending we we, we were trading with a platform called bitrex i know most of you uh, who are new into this ecosystem you may not know bitrex we had another platform again called cryptopia um, and there were a, and there were a few other platforms again so she will send um she will send this trade signal to the group i will send and that was how uh the that was how the african bitcoin traders what what many persons call a bit trader today was formed so the trade signal button is uh, a page that we send trade signal but this is only for subscribed only for those who subscribe to 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 enjoy this service and the service is 100 percent free but we are asking people to stake that coin to be able to access this so to access these trade signals you can stake that coin for one year which is for 12 months and after after this 12 month expires we will return you your exact number of that coin so let's say today that coin is currently selling for five cents and you staked 100 that coin to assess these trade signals and 12 months which is um which is may of 2021 that coin um that contract has expired what we will do is i will return your 100 that coin back to you even if that coin is now selling for 100 dollar for one so you see that you you didn't pay anything you didn't lose anything now why are we asking people to stick that coin to enjoy these trade signals the reason why we are doing this is because our company is deliberate to 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 we are deliberate to see the price of that coin grow from one cent that we launched in 2020 to where it is today now we want to see the price keep growing and what drives the price of every cryptocurrency up is when there is scarcity so people staking this third coin uh, uh, helps to control the circulating supply part time so that's why if you have noticed almost all our services is tied around services that people were supposed to be paying for we tied around people staking that coin so to get these trade signals that tells you what to buy i will open a trade signal victor are you subscribed to the trade signal mm -hmm. yeah, check the yeah log into the account and subscribe so i'm going to be i'm going to be reading out a, a trade signal that was sent to this application today many of you watching this video are subscribers already so this trade signal comes with the name of the coin to buy how much to buy it how much to sell and how much to stop loss so as we know all cryptocurrencies all cryptocurrencies are volatile except stable coins 
but every other cryptocurrency that is not a stable coin is volatile so there is something called stop loss there is something called stop loss so you can if for those of you that are logged in on the app now and you're taking a look the same way i'm looking at it the last signal that was sent to this app was sent around um okay 10 56 dubai time here so that is some few minutes ago and it said arbitrary that signal mid-term mid-term trade when it says mid-term trade it means it, it is a trade that you should hold within one week so which means if within this one week even if price goes down there is no need to set stop loss because it's term is it is termed a mid-term trade so it said buy og og use it said buy og with usdt what is showing is buy og slash usdt all cryptocurrencies listed on binance binance exchange that we are currently using are paired against other cryptocurrencies so what this buy og you og slash usdt on binance what it means is that you should use usdt usdt is a stable coin use it to buy another crypto called og on binance the buy price is 350 satoshi um, uh, the buy price is okay nine nine point three fifty us dollars the sell price one is ten point zero one seven now if you buy it at that nine point three fifty and you sell at ten point zero one seven you're making profit of six percent profit if you sell at sell price two which is ten point three nine five you're making profit of ten percent profit if you sell at sell price three which is ten point eight six seven you're making profit of 15 percent then it has sell price five this one this particular signal has up to sell price five so what it is giving you is that it's giving you option remember the first first thing you need to un understand is that everything about cryptocurrency there is no certainty it's always it's always under probability so the reason it's giving you more price more sell prices here after you buy is so that if you're someone that you're not patient enough you can sell off at sell price one and go with six percent profit if you're someone that you're very patient you you think long term you can hold it until you get to sell price two if you're more patient you can hold it until you get to sell price three if you're very very patient you can hold it until it gets to sell price four so it's give so this signal is giving you option to sell so it's just like somebody telling you buy this a uh, pack of chewing gum and buy it for one dollar and sell for two dollars or sell for twenty dollars so the market progresses as more people are buying the market price progresses so it has another most important thing added to this signal here called stop loss i said something here some few minutes ago i said in cryptocurrency it's only uncertainties there is no certainty nobody will tell you this one will do this or the other one will do that with all certainty so he, they are, we have added something here called stop loss which means that we are telling you that if you buy this coin at 9.350 dollars and the price is going down then the price has dropped down to 9.00 dollars sell it off now the reason why we are adding stop loss is that some coins can come down even below the price that you bought it some can even go as high as 30 percent loss 50 percent loss so this stop loss helps you to before you start this trade you already have where you are ready to quit this trade you already you before you enter this particular trade you already know that oh i'm going to set i'm going to i'm buying now at nine nine three eight five but i'm setting my stop loss at nine dollars so you're telling it you're telling the platform where you're buying this crypto that if the price starts dropping please don't hold my own until don't allow my own go below nine dollars let's take for example you have a sales girl and you sell let's say you sell this pack of chewing gum and you tell your sales girl that this thing is one dollar okay this thing is ten dollars but because of market demand and supply that controls the price if everybody in this market has started selling this thing for nine dollar please don't allow my own 
don't keep mine until the price gets to eight dollar once it gets to eight point fifty dollar sell off mine i don't care what happens whether the price goes down to zero i don't care just exit the sell price for me at uh, eight dollars or eight point fifty dollars what you have done is that you have secured your capital in trading it's very important that you learn how to preserve your capital it's not about the profit it's not about the profit but it's how to preserve your capital that is the most important thing in trading because your because in cryptocurrency trading your capital can go down to zero so but this is very very rare but your capital can go down to 30 percent this one is not rare some coin go down like that we saw bitcoin go from twenty thousand dollars nineteen thousand eight hundred dollars in 2017 to 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 um to to three thousand four hundred dollars in december in, in this in in january just two weeks apart or four weeks apart price went to nineteen thousand eight hundred dollars and dropped to three thousand eight hundred dollars so it, it it can happen to any cryptocurrency be it that coin be it bitcoin or any other cryptocurrency so this stop loss helps you to mitigate against loss so these are these are the services that you get when you subscribe to these trade signals the next button under it is tapped by that coin this is a very strategic button that we put there to connect to our quick swap the reason why this button this button is supposed to be quick swap button but because that coin is our that coin is our uh that coin is the transactional currency of the Abit network ecosystem and everything we are doing we building this app was for us to use as a use case for that coin so we put this button here called buy that coin once you click there it will open up the quick swap immediately but if you click on that button you can also choose to buy other coins instead of buying that coin but it's just strategically placed there to promote that coins so that button is called quick swap button now the reason for quick swap is that most people this platform is a peer-to-peer -peer platform too where you can meet other sellers and you can buy from them at their own price or you fix your own price and people who want will sell to you but the reason why there is this quick swap here is because most people don't want to go through the stress of coming online to chat people to call people oh please come online i am on your trade now i want to buy from you all those things people some some people don't want that stress so they just want as they're just coming they just deposit their money and they buy immediately so that is why this quick swap is here but the disadvantage also to you as a user is that the quick swap is always 15 percent or more higher than the market price you understand because the reason why it is like that now is because we want to encourage people to also learn how to use the peer-to-peer -peer. so we will so when you place this quick swap now let's say you want to quick swap 10 us dollars to yeah you want to quick swap 10 us dollars to 10 us dollar okay I'm using NGN. NGN is Nigerian Naira. Let's say you want to quick swap NGN to that. You want to convert uh, 10,000 Naira to, to that coin. It's going to show you the amount. Then it's going to show you how many you're going to get. Then it still pops up a message that says you will receive, okay, I'm swapping 1,000 Naira. So it says you will receive 850 Naira worth of that coin. Then it's showing you two options. The reason why it has not proceeded to swap is because we want you to see it it's showing you a green button and also a red button the red button says reject the the green button says accept so it's showing you that you will get 850 naira worth of that coin you're swapping 1000 naira but it's showing you that you're going to get 850 naira now it's a kindly check the calculation used for swap as we cannot reverse swap once it is done now this is a disclaimer letting you know that if you proceed by clicking this green button and you go ahead that you want to buy it at this rate that we are offering you we cannot listen to any complaint from you again about this so it will, it will also still tell you again say you can buy cheaper or sell higher using the peer-to-peer -peer buy sell button it's still telling you it's still telling you again that you're buying this thing now high but you can decide to go to the open market the open market is decentralized where we don't control how much users somebody can come there and say they want to sell their third coin that is currently selling at five cents for one cent 
somebody can come there and say they want to sell their third coin that is currently selling at five cents for one dollar so it's telling you that you can go to the open market and buy according to what you are ready to pay so if you go ahead and say yes you you want to swap it will swap immediately and it will show you swap successful and instantly your money will leave from your ngn wallet from the swapping wallet into the other wallet that you just bought so it's the same thing happens also for both sides both buying and selling now this swap is instant as you're swapping it you're getting it immediately there is no stress but the only thing is that extra there, there, there is always a percentage uh, higher higher than uh, uh than the current market price so you need to understand this we are using for this quick swap we are using a percentage higher than the current market price right so the next button there says learn trading in 2000 and, uh, in in i think it was 2015 i or there about i paid a guy i paid a white guy on facebook somebody shared his uh, youtube link so i chat him up on facebook and i told him i said bro i'm ready to learn this cryptocurrency trading i had already known about bitcoin i had already bought my bitcoin but i didn't know how to trade i was just an investor now on previous videos i have already explained the difference between a bitcoin investor and a cryptocurrency trader a bitcoin i said the bitcoin investor buys bitcoin cryptocurrency or any other cryptocurrency and keep a crypto investor just buys it and keep and the person is not bothered about whether the price is going up or down the person is thinking long term the person just bought it and kept it and is just waiting any year that price will go up and he will sell but a trader is someone that likes that price of cryptocurrencies go up and down because if price was not going up and down there will be no traders so what these traders do is that they take advantage of this price they take advantage of this price uh, movement up and down so i happened to learn this trading from a guy on facebook i paid him 800 dollars to teach me how to trade that guy teach me basically how to use uh, bitrex and the rest of and the likes of it but he didn't teach me technical and fundamental analysis i had to pay another nigerian guy again 350 dollars to teach me technical and fundamental analysis the next year in 2016 and he taught me and it wasn't too bright but my partner bitcoin goddess also straightened um, um also taught me more things about this technical and fundamental analysis so on this button here called learn trading you can you can click on that button now the first pop-up message we are trying our best to see that we explain to people every feature of this app as they click on it so that's why almost all the features of the app have a pop-up message to tell you what you are about to do so this pop-up message says our cryptocurrency classes are free but you have to stick that coin for 12 months to gain access to the free classes after 12 months your stick that coin will be returned to you at exact value state you just listen to me now tell you now that i paid over a thousand dollars to learn cryptocurrency trading and technical and fundamental analysis from two people you understand before we launched this application we used to charge people three hundred dollars to one thousand dollars to teach them how to trade and before we launched this application we had over thirteen thousand people in this community of traders you understand people who paid us there were certain times when we did promo we accepted hundred dollars we accepted uh, two hundred dollars but the fee was three hundred dollars so people paid us up to that amount to learn how to trade but what have we done as we launched this app as a use case for that coin we say no don't pay us again all you need to do is stake that coin equivalent of 150 dollars so remember i had already explained the reason why we are tying all our paying activities to staking the reason is because we want to reduce the circulating supply of that coin part time so everything that we used to charge money before we have converted it and say we don't want to charge money again buy that coin and stake it so this is what gives that coin utility this is why we often say that coin is a utility token when something is a utility token it means that it you use it to pay for that thing so but we are not charging people we are saying we are simply saying yes if you think this learning trading is valuable and if you think it's something that you want to do and you appreciate our service buy our utility token of our ecosystem stake it and enjoy this service 
for free. So the first class here says online video tutorial. On this online video tutorial, the first guy I learned trading from, he never even had a call with me for a day. He never had a call with me for a day. All he was just doing is sending me messages on Facebook and send me YouTube, send me YouTube link. He will send me YouTube link to watch videos. And in that video, he broke everything down step by step. So that was how I learned the first buy and sell, how to buy and sell on Bitrex and Cryptopia. So he did videos. So there is an online video class, but this online video class is it has been reduced to as small as $50. This is the same thing I paid $800. Don't forget. I paid this $800 to a white guy to teach me this. But we have brought it down to as low as $50 worth of that coin. Remember that it is free. You are just only taking this that coin to help us reduce the circulating supply of that coin. So you can decide to take the online class for $50. By staking $50 worth of that coin. The second class there is called the one-on-one -on -one training. 2016 to, 20, to 2020, myself and my partners, we were always having, if, if this was 2019 and you happen to call me, I will tell you I'm going to call you back because I will have classes scheduled for this time now with somebody that has met me on instagram and has paid me 300 dollars and i'm on phone now calling the person i'm telling the person oh yeah do this on bydex i'm showing the person on zoom what to do i'm showing the person do this do this do this buy this uh, this is how they use stop loss so this is what we were doing and this is what we are still doing so for this one-on-one -on -one training one-on-one -on -one online training now we will have a call with you we have our we have our professionals that handle this. Now, this, what these professionals do is that once you book for this one-on-one -on -one training now, they, they will ask you to choose, the app will ask you to choose time that you want to be having the class five times a week. So you will put those time on. Then the app will ask you also, the app will take you now to WhatsApp message of one of our professional trainers. And the person is going to book down your class. Once it is that time, if you say every 5 p.m., the person is going to call you or you're going to call the person and you guys will have the step-by-step -step class so on this one-on-one -on -one training now you're not just watching video online but you're talking to someone that is explaining to you how trading works explain you can ask questions this particular class goes for 150 150 dollar worth of that coin stick remember the classes are free the signals are free we are just saying if you really feel this thing is worth it hold that coins take it and enjoy this service so we are not saying that you are not paying us anything it's free but we are just saying if you think this thing is valuable buy our utility token and stake it so that you can enjoy this service after 12 months your 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 third coin that you staked probably must have gone high in price and you take it back so you didn't lose anything this is the same thing that people were paying us 300 dollars for and we are offering it now 100 percent free but we, are, we are bought, we are just saying buy that coin and take it out of out of uh, out of the circulating supply so that is the one-on-one -on -one training we also have the live training seminar we used to have an office in lagos we used to we also have an office right now that that exists in dallas texas in the usa we have an office right now in in we have an office in rwanda but we are going to close that one in rwanda we have an office in dubai where i am talking from now now in these live trainings you can walk into our training center every saturday and learn how to trade you see me you see me myself there you see other of our professionals there telling you this is how to read the chart this is this but that one goes for 500 dollars worth of that coin so you must buy 500 dollar worth of that coins take it and it will it will give you the address to come for the training but right now we are not offering that service on this app now because of the pandemic but it used to be there last year but because of the pandemic we are not offering that now because gathering is not allowed in most of the countries that we are currently operating so that is that for the training for the learn training below it we have the balance now you can see that this there is a space that displays your balance and because you might have people 
um, looking beyond, looking above your shoulder, we put an eye here, where a concealer, where you can decide for your balance to show, or your, or you can decide to hide your balance. Below that balance, uh, below that total wallet balance, that balance captures everything that is in your wallet. So let's say there are four wallets in this. There are four wallets in this uh in in the, in, in this platform that coin bitcoin ethereum and that and, and ngn so you can you, that wallet captures the balance of everything that you have and it display on the home page so you don't need to log in the wallet session to go see your balance you can see your balance on top so under it we have the deposit and withdraw buttons now how do people deposit money into this application you can deposit cryptocurrencies bitcoin ethereum tat coin tat n and the rest and you can also deposit uh, naira too on this platform before now the naira used to be automatic but when the cbn ban happened in one of the countries where we operate called nigeria the with the the they stopped giving us api to operate this so the deposit now for naira happens manually which means that you will you will click on this deposit it take you to our agent agent our agent gives you an account number to deposit once you deposit our agent will use a reference code that has already been generated for you and credit your account on our system now we also have the withdrawal side now on this withdrawal side now you can withdraw any type of cryptocurrency except for this naira which we are going to be starting very very soon too but you can withdraw bitcoin third coin ethereum and the rest all you need to do is put the wallet where you're sending this cryptocurrency to or where you're sending this money to and you will withdraw it there now you need to understand something because of the security of our platforms our withdrawals are our our withdrawals are our withdrawals are, are, are approved manually when we launched this system withdrawals was express which means that anytime you place withdrawal we don't even check if you have it in your in your account we just allow it to go but we discovered that we had a glitch everybody knows that everything tech there must be a glitch this one is not i'm not speaking french as far as it is tech, there must always be one issue or the other, which the developers handle. So we had a glitch that bloated the balance of some of our users. And these our users now, they never called our attention to it. Like somebody, somebody who had zero Bitcoin, but he saw seven Bitcoin on his wallet and he withdrew it. He even bought a house and did stuff. So because of that glitch that we had, we now said, we now researched and discovered that no cryptocurrency platform in this world right now runs express withdrawal but most of them have large teams that as soon as you place withdrawal they they, they verify your account balance immediately and they approve so some of them are very very fast because they have a large team and we are also building our own team right now so our withdrawal now take like one hour or more sometimes to get approved because we have our team is still a small team but we are still growing so we approve these withdrawals manually when you place a withdrawal it comes to our admin back end and we check if you have this balance that you're trying to withdraw if you don't have the balance we will reject the withdrawal and an automatic email will go to you with our with 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 uh, with uh, with uh, with the reason why we rejected your withdrawal and if you have that balance we will approve the withdrawal and you receive it in where you're sending it to that's it for the deposit and the withdrawal we also have the buy and sell button if you look down there now there is a yellow button called buy there is a there is a, a white button called sell now this buy and sell button is where our peer-to-peer -peer market is some people come to this app and they say and, and, and if i tell them you can buy peer-to-peer -peer at your own price or use quick swap they will tell me they have seen quick swap but they have not seen the the peer-to-peer -peer. so the peer-to-peer -peer is linked to this buy and sell button once you click on the buy it will ask it will, it will first of all welcome you say welcome to abby trader trade page to buy from other traders in your country or globally by yourself please click on the peer-to-peer -peer. now cryptocurrencies were created to be operated strictly as peer-to-peer -peer, where buyer sends money to seller and seller credits uh, 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 and seller credits buyer's wallet using something called escrow. Escrow is 
both of us are transacting. You want to buy this thing from me. I don't know you. I don't trust you. So we look for a middleman that both of us trust. And I say, take this thing to so and so place and drop. This person, I can trust this person. And once you drop it there with this person, I will send my money to you. And this person that both of us trust will send my 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 box of chewing gum to me that is how the escrow works so if you want to sell your cryptocurrency and you want to use the the the, the peer-to-peer escrow the platform collects that amount that you said you want to sell and hold it then when a buyer comes the buyer transfers money to you the buyer charts you up gets your account number transfer money to you and clicks i have paid once the buyer click i have paid the um the platform tells the buyer that you have that you have been paid confirm in your account now there are certain laws that guide this escrow i need to explain uh, i don't know how to put it in big grammar but i need to carefully explain it to you guys that you need to understand if you are a seller and somebody chats you up and said they have paid don't click the i have received payment button if you have not logged into your bank account number and seeing that you have seen the money in your account. Because once you click that you have received payment, when truly you have not, the platform does not understand. It will release the coin to the person because you have clicked on that action. Then if, if you, are the, if, if you as, as the buyer too, if you have not made payment and you come and click, I have paid, the person has the right to report to you. And on this our platform, we are very strict because we are a startup. We want to build with, with, with high discipline for our users. We want our users to be able to trust our platform. So when you come to this place now and click, I have paid, when you have not paid, if you do it twice, our users can report you and we will ban you and seize every asset in your account. So we always put this warning there that if you have not paid, don't click i have paid this escrow is one of the safest place in the world to trade so when you come here now you will see like this is this person this person's name the first person in my front here is a he god's power the person wants to sell that coin he wants to sell 961 that coin what is his price the first thing i see is his price he's currently selling one third coin for 55 naira and what is the limit that he wants to sell he wants to sell the least he wants to sell is 50,000 naira and the highest he wants to sell is 52,000 naira so i will look at this person trade is this price okay for me do i want to buy at this price above the, below this person another person called ibrahim is offering to sell me the same third coin is for 50 naira so i have the option to choose to trade with ibrahim instead of this god's power so you can see that different buyers put their different price below this below this uh ibrahim is another person called stanley stanley is ready to sell to me at 40 naira for one third coin so the prices are arranged from the highest to the lowest so people that wants to sell at very high price we put their own up and people that want to sell at low price their own follows down so you can choose which one you want to buy you can see here now one person said 55 he said if it's not 55 don't chat him so if you've seen that this person's sell order if you've seen that this person's sell order is this person want to sell at 55 it will be a sin on your part to go chat to this person if you're not ready to buy at his price because you will just have wasted his time because once you start chatting this person now we have removed the person's trade from the market which means other users that are coming now are not seeing this person again in the market so when you come scroll until you see someone that their price is comfortable for you don't go around on this app chatting one person to the other telling them to reduce their price it's against the law of this application to chat people to tell them to reduce their price for you because there are always people ready to sell at a price that you want now, if you go through this market order all and you can't see the price that is good for you, go and create your own buy order. If you go through the, the, the sell side and you can't see any price, maybe everybody is increasing their price, their price is not okay for you, go and use the same buy and sell button and create your own sell and create your own buy order. So you can go there and you, you have checked through. 
what you really want to buy is you're ready to pay let's say 30 naira for one third coin but you have checked the least person here is saying if it's not 40 is not selling don't bother chatting that person to reduce their price to 30. if you do that we are going to if, if we do that and we find that we are going to block you from the system what you, all you need to do is go to your own app go to you go to your own application to the buy and sell button and create your own offer and say i want to buy fifty thousand naira worth of that coin i am buying my price is 30 naira and you put all your own terms there too and it we will approve it and it will go to the market and it will be displayed when people come to when people that want to sell to comes to they will be seeing your own order the way i have seen these people's order so there are certain uh, rules and terminologies that are used on this peer-to-peer on a very good day, the peer-to-peer -peer is the fastest place to buy. It's very, very safe. And if everybody plays by the rule, there is no problem. But even, even if people don't play by the rule, there is still no problem because it might actually delay you. If somebody clicks, I have paid when they have not paid you. All you need to do is just wait until the trade time expire and you click raise dispute our admins are always on the dispute page waiting for you to report someone and say this person click i have paid when they have not paid so that admin will the immediately you raise dispute the the, the system automatically adds you and the person that you raise dispute with into a single chat so we will be seeing that person and we'll be seeing you and we will not send a message now you you click you have paid when you have not paid provide evidence that you have paid the person can provide evidence that he has paid sometimes people have paid but because of bank delays so the person can upload his own evidence that he has paid you you, you they say they have paid you and you are saying that you have not received payment victor come and give me this my uh, laptop chair. i don't know what's holding it okay she was she was holding it there so you somebody is saying that he has paid you yeah thank you yeah sorry so you somebody's clicking that he has paid you and you are saying that you have not received the money we will we will not tell that person go and print your bank statement with the stamp of the bank on it so the reason why we are saying people should be very straightforward when, when you're dealing here is not because somebody is going to lose their money or their coins, but because of the delay that comes with it. So this person will have to go to his bank now and print his account statement showing that he didn't receive the money. Once well, this person brings his account statement and his bank said they didn't receive the money and you are still insisting that you have paid, all what we need to do is send these details to the bank to confirm that actually no money entered this account and we will we will def we will release the person's coin back to him now the reason is that that very moment when you click i have paid our system has locked up the person's token so which means that even if that person's mother is dying even if the person's father is dying even if anything is happening to that person the person cannot get access to that his coin that he wanted to sell so it will be so inhuman of you to click i have paid when in actual sense you have not paid that person so which is why we are very very strict if we find out that you are in the habit of always clicking i have paid when you have not paid once first user reports you second user reports you will just block you immediately you cannot use our system again and we are even bringing stricter measures where we will take everything that is in your wallet if you have the habit of going around clicking i have paid then if the if true true you have paid this person it's on both sides some people are also wicked too that they will receive payment and they will not want to release the coin so the person has received payment and the person has gone to watch football instead of releasing the coin so you have not lost your money don't 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 forget i said the coin is always with the escrow that very moment the person is creating the the sell order we have the coin already so if you have paid the person the person has not clicked excuse me the person has not clicked i have received money to release coin to you don't cry don't bother yourself we are going to we are going to just raise dispute
You also that also made payment too, you also have the right to, to raise dispute. Anybody can raise dispute. Once you raise dispute on a particular trade, we will add that person that you trade, the person that, that you traded with will be added there immediately. And we will now ask that person, go print your account statement. But if we find out that truly you paid this person, but the person is the, the person didn't release the coin to you we are going to penalize this person too so there is punishment for both the buyer and the seller that is not straightforward so this escrow is very very safe we also have uh, below it we have the wallet now this wallet is where you see the balance of every crypto that you have this place is like it's like your money house this is where you see all the crypto that you have you can see how many bitcoin you have how many task coin you have how many ethereum you have we also have the profile page the profile data page now on the personal profile or the personal data page you can see if you click there you will see your name like on this one is dominic jakes you will see the person's email you will see the person's phone number and you have you you can edit it and you can also do we also have under it the referral link now most people most people make money referring people to use products or services so you can i know people who their business with us is that they have used our application and the app is good and what they are actually doing is referring their friends to use this platform and we pay them as high as one dollar for every referral that they bring to this platform that transacts with us i know people that are earning up to one thousand dollars doing this a month so if you're someone that people trust you and you know a lot of people this is another way to make money sharing your referral link so it's a use the link to invite your friends to join by creating an account on our big network and we will give you one dollar for each of them after their first transaction so if you use this your link now send to your father send to your girlfriend or whoever the person is to you if that person transacts on our platform immediately the person transact will give you one dollar even if the person is transacting even if it's 10 10 kobo the person is transacting even if it's one cent we will give you one dollar now we also have the currency changer on this platform now you can see that looking at my home page now my account is showing in dollars so i can decide to go to that currency changer now and make my balance to show in naira i can decide to go there and make it to show in pounds i can decide to go there and make it to show in ghana cities i can decide to go there and make it to show in euros so on this currency changer page you can change your account to show in you can change your account display currency to show any country now we have the reset wallet passcode some people put set wallet passcode because you need anytime you want to access your wallet you need four pins to log into this your wallet so some people forget this pin probably because of so many problems of life so they forget the four pin passcode that they use so you can come here and reset this pin and we will send something to your email and once you put that correct details we you, you can get back access to your wallet we have the activate price alert the activate price alert is one feature that has that every full-time trader needs the price of cryptocurrency goes up and down per second don't forget, I have emphasized this talking about the risk and the gains. Where I said it is because of this up and down, like people like myself are making money because we buy when the price is down and we sell when the price is up. So you can set price and lag and say, when that coin is five cents, notify me so I can buy. When that coin drops to four cents, notify me so I can buy. Please, when it's at ten cents, notify me so I can sell. So with this price alert now, you can do this for that coin, Bitcoin, and Ethereum. So you can say, if Bitcoin is now sixty thousand dollars, tell me. So this price alert will always send you a message whenever it gets to the price that you set. We have the next of kin feature on this particular. Our platform is the first cryptocurrency platform that has nest of kin feature i've always told the story of what inspired this 20 in 2018 i was in a dark place in my life and i had one friend online i met him on instagram wally this guy 
was also a cryptocurrency enthusiast like myself. We always talk about uh, Bitcoin and cryptocurrencies, trading and everything. We always share ideas. I was somewhere then, so we always talk at night. So I became so close to this guy that we talked at least once or twice in a week, every night. So one day I sent him a message and the wife replied to that message, say, ah, sorry, Wale is dead. I said, what happened to him? He said he was knocked down by a bike. Man, I was so devastated. This was someone I talked to last week. Few days later, I sent a message to console or to, to I sent I sent I sent a console I sent a condolence message to the wife and just to condole with them and she said that uh, they are taking Wale to Ondo State where he comes from in Nigeria. Those of you watching this that are from Nigeria, you probably know where I'm talking about. So he said they are taking Wale for for burial in his state for to do a funeral in his state, but that they need support. And I, I was not asking myself. I said support. And I asked the wife. I said sorry. Didn't Wale tell you guys that he had some Bitcoin? And she said something that inspired us putting this nest of kin here. She said, Wale didn't really show me how this thing works. I was always hearing you people talking here about this Bitcoin Ethereum in the night. Wale didn't really show me. And I asked myself, I have two kids. I have, I have my wife and my sons. Now, let's say my wife is not interested in knowing about the, how this Bitcoin and cryptocurrencies work. What happened as I'm sitting down here now? something happens to me maybe i just sit down here now and something happens to me and i'm gone what happens to my asset on most of these exchanges most of these cryptocurrency exchanges today they have assets of people that died and left them so people have died and left crypto assets on most of these exchanges so when she told me this thing i now said wow so I sent my support that I, that I could send at that point in time in my life. And they did, they, they did the funeral and everything. And I now asked myself, what will happen to users of our platform who died or uh, 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 who, 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 who died or they, 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 or they have an ailment that, that means that they cannot log in into their platform again? Because life and uncertainties. Everything can happen to anybody, even myself sitting down here. So what happens if that person cannot log in again? So will their asset remain with us here? And because we cannot use their asset, because their asset is always safe on this platform now, what happens to their families that they leave behind? And I knew quite well that Wale had up to eight Bitcoin as at that time. Even though Bitcoin was around $10,000 then or, or there about, or less. So that Bitcoin was enough to give him a befitting barrier, but because his wife doesn't know and he didn't teach his wife how this thing works and everything, all those assets is now with that exchange and it will just be there, waste forever. If they had a kid, now that kid is going to grow up in poverty. Meanwhile, the father had, imagine your dad has huge real estate plantation and you don't know that your dad had it and you don't know how to have access to it. That was why we designed this nest of kin feature on the app. So the, when you click on this nest of kin feature, you say, welcome to Arbitrator nest of kin feature. We care about the feature of your digital asset and investment on our platform, as we believe that it can grow generally Generationally. Kindly provide contact details of trusted family or associate that you would love us to get in touch with. In situations when you have been inactive on this platform due to unforeseen occurrence like death or health reasons. So we put this nest of kin here so that in case because of health or any unforeseen occurrence like death and you can't log in again, you have filled this nest of kin feature, we will reach when you say, if you say we should contact your nest of kin after six months, if you don't log in, our application automatically will send a message, an email and a text message to your nest of kin, asking that person, do you know Gaius Chibweze? My wife will say yes. He say, we have not heard from Gaius Chibweze for the last six months. Oh, my wife will say, oh, sorry, Gaius Chibweze died uh, last month or anything happened. Oh, Gaius Chibweze has health condition now that he cannot talk again. Oh, he has lost his memory. Oh, something happened, one thing or the other happened. So the platform will now return this message to our admins and our admins now will now send them 
ask them for certain things. If they say, oh, Gaius Chibweze is dead, he died last month, they'll say, okay, can you provide the death certificate of Gaius Chibweze? He had so so and so asset. Gaius Chibweze had 1,000 Bitcoin on this platform and he used you as the next of king. So can you provide his death certificate and every other evidence to show that truly Gaius Chibweze is dead? And let's say my wife that I use as my next of kin now provides it. This, my asset on this platform will be transferred to my wife and my two sons can have a better life even if I'm no longer here. So this is why we put this next of kin feature. So it's a very good feature that I feel we are the first and the only platform that have it right now in the cryptocurrency space. Even the big giants in the crypto space don't have this feature. And this is why most of our users trust us to keep the cryptocurrencies here. So that is the next feature under that profile. We have the Reset Google Authenticator. We often hear about um, a Bitcoin wallet hack and every other thing. So People or platforms use Google Authenticator to protect the user. If you set your Google Authenticator, only those keys that you set can access your account. So we put this Google Authenticator. So anytime somebody wants to send out an asset from this wallet now, we will ask for this Google Authenticator that you have set on your phone. So if they put another numbers that are not the exact keys that Google Authenticator is generating, that 12 seconds, they cannot withdraw from this application so that is that is that about this place so we also have by the top left hand side we have the get signals i already explained what signals are become a third coin vendor now most of you who have followed us or who are already users you know we launched a verification service called that coin vendors whereby we give some of our traders active traders bash they verify with their id card so you can apply to become a that coin vendor which means that we will give you a special badge that differentiates you in the market from other people that are buying and selling too there are some people who this is their full-time work what they do is buy and sell that coin i know a whole lot of them many of them are first-time millionaires right now because of doing this so you can become a that coin vendor before now now, all we needed to give you that bash was just for you to was just for you to uh, was just for you to put your national ID or whatever. But in this latest update that we launched now, you will have to 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 stake five hundred dollar worth of that coin as security deposit. Now, why did we introduce this security deposit? Now we discovered that some of our users who had this bash. This bash became so rampant that everybody was having it on the market order and it's not supposed to be like that. Not everyone on Instagram is verified, right? So this bash became too rampant. Now, some of these users that we were just verifying now, we were just verifying so casually now. What they were doing now is that they go and wait on the app for new people. When these people chat them up, they will tell them, release the coin, no problem. Click on release coin. When you release coin, I'm going to pay you. They will tell them, they will tell them, they will tell them, um, they will tell them, um, they, will, they will tell them, uh, I have made payment. When, when they have made, they will just waste their time. So when people, we want to make becoming a verified vendor hard, so that by the time you go through this process, you know that, oh, you have $500 worth of that coin at stake. That if you scam anybody on this platform in the name of I'm a verified vendor, if you do anything, we can always use that as a security deposit. And it's going to also make only quality people, only people who are sincere and transparent to use the service and use it for exactly why we created it so you can click here and you can stake and become and upload your id card and you become a verified vendor now the sweet part of it is that if at any time you have become a verified vendor maybe you have made so much money because when people come to the app and they see that you have a verification badge and not everybody has a verification badge people will tend to trust you more and deal with you then that is one of the benefits the second benefit is that we we approve uh, market orders and withdrawals of our verified vendors we give it the priority because those people are like vips of our platform every service not everybody 
many of you watching this now, you have not, you, you know that not everybody flies first class. You understand? And if you're, if you're sitting on, on first class, I've joined, I've joined Emirates. I think I was, I think I was going to, I think, I don't know where I was going to, but was I coming to Dubai? But I flight Emirates one day, I flight Emirates one day, and I passed along the first class. When I saw, when I saw the, when, when I saw the treatment they were giving to people in the first class, man, I told myself, man, it's time to upgrade. You understand? So these people are like the first class users that we have in the market order. So we also have the transaction history. Now this transaction history shows you all your transactions that you have done on our platform. We also have the stake history. For people who have staked, you can go there and see when you staked, how much you have staked, and when it's going to expire. We also have the escrow history. Escrow history shows you all your coins that are in the escrow, how much everything that you have transacted with shows you on the escrow for record purpose. We also have the order book. If you place a buy and sell market order, it goes to the order book. And anytime you want to delete it, you can just go to the order book and delete it. We also have the get help and support. As you know, every tech platform will always have issues. Go to Facebook right now. Go to Facebook app on their, on their app review. You will see people complaining. I downloaded this latest version. It is not working. This is the same Facebook some of you are using to watch me. Go to Instagram, the same thing. I downloaded this latest version of Instagram. It's not compatible with my phone. So users will always have one complaint or the other. And because we are a company built on customer service, we work hard every day to see how we can offer our customer the best service to keep them. So... You can click on this get help and support session and you tell us your complaint. Maybe you log into the app and something happened, your balance is no longer showing. You can just report it there. You understand? So you can use this get help and report it or you can, this is the first place to report it and the best place to report it. But you can also go to our social media like our Instagram. Now, some of you, you do it very, very wrong. And I'm particularly referring to people who are holding that coin. When you have issues, what you should do is go to the DM of that platform and complain inside the DM and not go to the comment section and complain. You understand? This is a platform you claim to love. Some of you will claim, oh, you love Tatcoin, you're promoting Tatcoin, you have bought Tatcoin. So by the time you go to the comment section and you're complaining there, you are not doing the right thing. Go to the DM. Why? Because the comment section is not meant for complaint. You're just supposed to go to the DM where we are always there and we'll look at your issues and we are going to sort it. So you understand? So if you have issues, you have any complaint using any of our platform, go to this uh, get help session and go to the com go to the uh, DM of our page and complain and not the comment session. Why? Because if you're commenting, oh, if you're, if you're leaving uh, comments in the comment section, Naturally, what it does is that it tells other people that are coming to use this app that ah, this app you can't trust it, and it's very unfair. Why? Because some challenges are are pecu are, are, are not uh, general. They are just a special kind of. It's like 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 am I logging now? Everybody here now. Am I logging now? And I'm seeing my balance. But one person among us here will log in and will not see their balance. So that doesn't mean that the app is trash. It just means that it's, it's a tech issue. And sometimes the compatibility of the phone and, 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 and the app. So when you have issues on our platform, we beg you to come to our DM or use the Get Help session and you report. Our customers have rated us highly because they know that we always solve every issue that they have on our platform. You understand? So that is that, is that about the Arbitrator app for today. So I have explained every of the future oh i think i didn't explain stick victor open this wallet so i can go to the stick please thanks so last but not the least now is the stick now many of you watching this now are customers with a bank you have an account with a bank and your bank is telling you Come and open a fixed deposit account. Put 10,000 Naira. If you put 10,000 Naira, we will give you so-so and so amount of money. 
as return on investment. So in cryptocurrency, it's called decentralized finance. So we also offer this taking, but only for Tatcoin, because Tatcoin is our utility token. So we are offering this service and say, stake your Tatcoin for, for 12 months list and get 20% extra on top. This 20% means that if you stake 100 Tatcoin, we will add you 20 Tatcoin to the 100 and you will now have 120 Tatcoin. So this is our own kind of fixed deposit in the cryptocurrency world. So what this does, what is our own benefit and why are we investing? Check, to check, sorry. Sorry, guys. So, and why are we investing in it? Now, we are investing in it because people, when people stake, so, uh, so uh, sorry, my, when people stake, now, when people stake, they are, they are reducing the circulating supply of the coin. Right? When, when people stake, they are reducing the circulating supply of the coin. So, and this is why we give them this ROI to, 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 to serve as a compensation for this service. So, it's very important that you understand how every of these features works. Now, um, on the wallet session, we have Touchcoin, we have TATN, we have BTC, we have NGN, and we have ETH. So, all you need to do is, if you're yet to download this app, now download this app and you will see all the services I have, I have talked about. Now, on this homepage too, you can also see too that, um, you can also see the price of you can see the life price of that coin. You can see the life price of Bitcoin. You can see the life price of Ethereum. You can also see the life price of that end. So you can also use this app now just to just be not, uh, monitoring what the price of Bitcoin is, what the price of Ethereum is, what the price of that coin is. So I will open the comment session now for, I will take two, two comments from each of the from each of the applications. So I've opened on my page and also on Abit Network. Okay, I think this is Abit Trader. So ask me any question that is regard that 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 is related to what we have talked about. Okay, perfect. Ask me any question that is related to what I've talked about. Okay, guys on Facebook, you can actually ask too. So I will be taking uh, a few questions. So come with, please. What's the app name? Okay, the app name is called Abi Trader. For those of you who just joined us, the app is called Abi Trader. So I just took my time now to explain everything. Can this video be available to watch later? Yes, definitely. I'm going to post all these videos on all the pages I'm streaming right now. After downloading the app, I need to sign up, right? Yes, you definitely need to sign up. That's how you have an account. So, yeah. Okay, guys. So, I see that you guys don't have any question to ask me. So, next week, I've taken over 6,000 tabs, but I still don't have access to Signals or Tutorial. Okay, good. Now, there's something I also need to explain. For every of our staking, there is a service attached to it. We have staking for ROI. This staking is the one that you stake 100 third coin and you get 120 third coin at the end of the contract, which is 12 months. There is a staking for learning. You stake and you learn. There's a staking for signal. There is also a staking now for to become a verified vendor. The thing is, if you if you go stake for becoming a verified vendor, you can't use it to assess the training. If you stake for the training, you can't use it to assess the becoming a verified vendor. So you must stake on the right page. How long does this training on training last on the app? The training is until you know everything that we are teaching you. Okay, guys, I see the guys on Facebook don't have any question. Can one who is in an Abid Reb, yes, attend the Osun meetup? Yes, definitely. That, that very meetup is for every person interested in our platform. Sorry, sir, but I was asked about that question on real estate app. Okay, good. So I'm going to talk about those apps 
another day so i think Ajulu, if you're watching this now i think the next series should be about our abit crowd and abit farm app i think people need people want to be enlightened more about these applications so Okay, perfect. God's will or God's power or contest. Asking guys, Shibuze, I'm new to your page. Want to ask what is the market capitalization? Okay, good. Touch coin uh, market. Uh, Victor, do you have a coin market cap on your phone or coin Giko? Mm -hmm. Okay, good. Okay, guys. So I can't really check it. As at last time I checked, Touch coin had a diluted market cap, which is straight from Ita's can straight from itascan itascan is where it was created it has a diluted market cap of 10 million us dollars now for the circulating supply we released only 65 million touch coin and out of this 65 million touch coin our users our users have staked 42 million now the the the, the, the left of the, now we have also used 8 million touch coin to pay as return on investment for staking so which means that to to check the total now it, now in circulation now you just put that eight million plus the eight million plus uh, the eight million plus the thirty four million so put eight million plus thirty four it will give you the total tax coin that is expected to be in circulation Victor where's your calculator here yeah, just go there so eight million plus thirty you know, forty Okay, 65. Okay, 65 minus 42, 23 million plus 8 million plus 8. So we have a total of about 31 million touch coin in circulation. Can I hold Binance coin in my Arbitrader? Binance coin wallet is not on Arbitrader, but we are launching another platform called ArbitPay, which I'm going to be talking about in the next video. That platform has binance coin wallet so we are launching another platform we are launching our payment gateway called a bit pay app so that a bit pay has binance coin wallet it also has usdt wallet and we'll soon be adding dogecoin and other coins if i buy that coin below market if i buy that coin below market rate and sell above what i bought get it and sell above what i bought but still below market rate am i at loss being at loss or at profit is simple mathematics. If you buy two, if you buy one dollar and sell one point five dollars, you're still in profit. If you, so, it's it's just simple maths. It doesn't mean you can buy that coin for you can you can buy that coin for you can buy that coin for let's say five cent and you sell for five point five cent, even while the price is. 10 cents you are still in profit but the thing is that you didn't want to get 20 or you didn't want you you, you decided that that you wanted to sell below the market price good boss good evening how much is that coin now how much is one third coin in naira i think one third coin in naira right now is 34 naira can i do arbitrage with arbitrator yes people have people have probably been doing that go to buy decks and buy and sell on our peer-to-peer -peer. that one is normal before before now i go to binance and buy bitcoin and go to local bitcoin and and set a high price and sell so achieve are they charges accrue when you trade on the app like small deductions of that coins when we sell good we charge one percent of this for the market order the peer-to-peer -peer market we charge i think one is one one is one percent we charge for market orders Please. yes no, 2%. okay we charge two percent for the market orders Thanks, I'm in Dubai. I will link up. Okay, bro. We are having our office opening in Dubai. It's one of the biggest events that we are having. So, where we are going to be talking about our next five years roadmap. We are, we are going to be unveiling two products, Abit Pay and Abit Play. Abit Play is our gaming platform where people can play games and earn real touch coin. Abit Pay is our, is our payment gateway where people can use touch coin to shop. People can use that way vendors can accept that coin as means of payment people can use that coin as collateral to collect loan in bitcoin ethereum and other cryptocurrencies so it's one of the biggest 22nd of may here in dubai if you are in dubai i'm inviting you to be part of this i'm going to post i'm going to post the venue for the event follow our official pages at abit network and you're going to be updated about this event it's one of and we're also doing an unveiling 
We're also doing un un unveiling of so many things, new members that are joining our team. In fact, you're going to be wowed that very day. It's a very big event for us. Also, which happens to be when we are going to be celebrating our two years anniversary. So if you are if you are in the UAE, if you are in Dubai, you are in Abu Dhabi or any any of its environs, I am inviting you. So I can't withdraw. I already explained this. But can I buy a hard tackle and trust one? Perfect. Even has price there now. What if the nest of kin details wasn't available? How can a family get used to this account? If you don't put your nest of kin, there's no how we can update it. So there is something that's confusing me. Is it however different? What is the difference in ERC and BSC? Now we have a central wallet that holds both ERC20 and BSC. So on our platform, you can deposit into that one wallet. But when you're sending out, you must make sure that you're using the right wallet for that particular coin. Please, I can't stick my third coin arbitrary. They always tell me that I need to have about 404. Perfect. The least amount you can stake is $25. If you're, if this is your 500, if this number that you're trying to stake is not up to that amount, it can't stick. When you want to send from Bidex, BSC to Trust Wallet, perfect. So when you want to send to from Bidex, Bidex listed, Bidex didn't add a wallet for BSC. Instead, they list, yes, they added a separate wallet. They didn't uh, uh, use a central uh, system that you can choose which wallet you're sending to. So they have that BEP20 is slash NGN. So you can withdraw that coin on Binance Smart Chain on Bidex. You can buy that BEP and withdraw it to BSC. I'm new to Abit Network. Must I stake that coin? Perfect. Yes, you have to stake $30 worth of that coin to become an Abit rep. The only way you can show us that you believe in in Abit Network and you want to promote our platform is by owning that coin. You can't promote you can't promote something you don't believe in. So that is why it's compulsory that you must take thirty dollar worth of that coin to become an Abit reps. When are you launching Abit Play? Abit Play and Abit Pay will launch on the twenty second of May. What is the work of ROI? Can't you explain? What is the work of ROI? Why can't you explain that ROI? Perfect. I already explained it. I said the work of ROI. ROI means return on investment, which, which most platforms call it average percentage rate. Like when you are, when you have a savings account, that is what they give to you for savings. So that is the work of ROI. If I stake as a verified vendor, no, you cannot stake as a verified vendor and be receiving ROI. ROI has its own staking, which is the which is the direct staking. Hello, boss. The stake type for signal is it flexible? Is it fixed? Can I unstake at any time? You cannot unstake for the signal. It's a twelve month contract. So if you stake for the signals, it's going to stay staked until after twelve months. The new development of early ROI and stake affect those who already receive ROI? No, no. This new development only starts from those who staked after the new development. Can you take off Naira rate? The Naira rate is making people think the rate is high, but if having it in dollar will make people realize that it is cheap. 0 0.03 is so cheap. It pumps it to 0 0.3. Okay, I'm not really think. I don't really think the Naira rate is a problem. Every other platform that target nine, target the Nigerian market, have, have, um, they they have Naira rate on their platform. If even on, I downloaded Trust Wallet this morning, and and it was also showing me in Naira rate. Every platform that targets Nigeria. On, on on this our application if you change your if you change your display currency to 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 us you can see your wallet in us so i don't really think that affects it people who pe people who want to buy will always know that a token that is selling below 50 naira or at 50 naira, even 100 naira, even 500 naira is still fucking cheap hello boss the tech talk question okay i've answered this how do I apply to become a bid vendor? I was declined twice. Good. So to become that vendor, you need to hold your ID card to your face. I have done this for many platforms. I did this for Coinbase. I did this for Binance. So you hold your ID card by your hand. You hold your passport by your hand. Keep it close to your face. You understand? Write the date of that very day and hold it. The reason for this is for KYC reasons. 
so that in case anything to protect you and other users what is the latest means of buying that kind of drug? you can buy that coin with naira or any other currency bitcoin and ethereum chief explain more about a and rock and that coin eth and bitcoin okay bro i already did all this click the link on this page bio now you see all those videos i do these videos weekly so we have explained everything just watch it my team have edited these videos they are all there i've explained what bitcoin is i even explained it here today when i post this you can watch it but what do you mean by steak i already explained what steak is so watch this video when 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 we are out of here okay guys so i thank you guys so much i thank you guys so much for um joining this live video we are going to do another live video again next week and it promises to also be very very interesting interactive just the way it has been so i thank you guys so much for using our platform if you've not downloaded arbitrator app download our app called arbitrator it even if even if you're not buying cryptocurrency yet you can just watch the videos of how it works where we explain everything about cryptocurrencies this person say i cannot log in my habit network again if you can't log in again i've, I've already explained here how you can drop your complaint and we are going to sort it i can log in thousands of people watching this can log in so it's it's just uh probably it's a device problem or something chief you are the bomb may god bless you thank you so much thank you so much i appreciate all of you thank you so much for joining us it's um it's already past midnight here in dubai so i need to i need to run now thank you guys so much today's um i i believe today's uh program has been very very uh informative as always so follow our business pages at abit network get yourself some tart coin right now i always say this the best time to buy every cryptocurrency. You see, everybody, Dogecoin is pumping right now. Everybody is rushing to buy it. But these same people, if you told them about it last year when it was cheap, they will not want to go close to it. The best time to buy every cryptocurrency is when the price is low. What we are building in Abit Network has never been built before. We are launching a platform where people can give loans and take loans with their third coin launching next week we are launching a platform where people can play games with their third coin we are launching a platform where people can listen to music people can listen to music and the artist earns money in third coin we are launching a platform where people can stream movies where people can stream movies and pay with that coin all this are uh, all this we are we are building inside the habit play hub which is going you you can go there and download games you can go there and download music you can you, you can go there and stream music you can go there and watch movies so you understand what we are building is very big i need you guys to to i need you guys to 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 get on board get on board what we are building is so big that if you don't get on board 3 years from now definitely you're going to be wishing you had you had gotten on board right now you understand that coin is still very very cheap the only way to come into our ecosystem right now is to use our products and as you already know the only way to use our products is using that coin almost everything on our ecosystem is free if you have that coin so i need you guys to get on board talk to your friends talk to your talk talk to your spouse whoever whoever you need to talk to get them on board if you're already a tata i thank you guys so much for 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 joining me in today's program and we are going to talk about other of our products next week promises to also be very educative and informative so so have a great i don't know wherever you are right now have a wonderful day or have a wonderful night god bless you guys